When you are inserting a drop down menu in Excel, it is called data validation. In this example, we would like a drop down menu in cell A1, and we would like that menu to contain four options. We're going to use trainee, junior, staff, and manager. So we're going to type those in over on the right in any cell. In this one, we're using L. We're then going to click back on A1 and click on data. We are then going to select data validation and go to settings. Under settings, you're going to have allow list, meaning you're, you want to insert a list. You're then going to select source and this means what do you want to populate that list. So we're going to select the four options over on our right. And we're actually going to create an error alert so that if you don't select one of those four options, it gives you a warning. You can do stop, you can do warning, you can provide information. So we're going to go with warning and we're going to title that warning invalid. And then you can put a little error message in. So I'm going to say, uh, please select from the drop down menu. We're then going to hit OK. And you will see that our cell A1 now contains our drop down menu with our four options. And if we try to insert a different word, in this case I'm just going to type in test, you will see that our invalid error message pops up. So it's letting us know that we need to select an option from the drop down menu. And that's exactly what we wanted it to do. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Please do let me know if you would like to see more by giving this video a thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe and of course follow Executive Assistant How To on LinkedIn.